Hey all, welcome to Mono, our newest flex team that we're about to launch. In this video, I wanted to talk about how versatile Mono is. We are packing this incredible theme with over 100 predefined flex blocks, with over 20 page template layouts, and an exciting feature that we're launching together with Mono, uh, which is a library of uh, style kits. So a style kit is uh, consisting basically of typography combinations or font combinations, color schemes, and um, 20 unique blocks. So we are launching 12 of these style kits together with Mono. And that means if you're happy with Mono the way it is in terms of style and the modern aesthetic, the clean aesthetic that it comes with, that's great. But if your branding has a bit of a different visual identity, uh, you have an option to add an additional style kit to your uh, mono style. And that means you can choose from 12 different style kits. These include uh, styles from all of our flex themes, as well as six of our classic themes. And in this video, I will go over uh, four pages that I have created for different type of businesses using Mono's layouts with a style kit and its unique blocks. So let's start with the first page that I've built out and it's a blogger lifestyle kind of a homepage. I'm using Evora style kit here. Evora is one of our classic themes um, and you'll notice that I already have kind of um, different fonts here. And this slider is actually from Mono. I have my latest post or featured post that I can show here. Moving next, I'm using a unique block from the Evora style kit that we have prepared um, to present myself. You can see again, the fonts are all switched up. The, the colors are also from Evora. I have my top categories. This is a layout from Mono. And I added a bit of personalization as well by adding underlines under the text. Um, so that just shows you that not only you can use the layouts, you can use the style kit, but you can also add on more personalization if required on top of that. So I have my, uh, my main categories, my latest posts again here, and some more categories, featured categories to link through. And as you can see, again, I've added this underline just to make it a bit more exciting within this page. So this is a page, again, achieved with Mono, with Mono's predefined layouts and um, Evora style kit and unique block from, unique blocks from Evora. Next one is a makeup artist um, a web page. This is something that I've created, again, with some of Mono's layouts, but also a lot of it is really our Lovely style kit. So Lovely is also a classic theme and we've um, added this uh, style kit within the library. So um, I'm using some of the unique blocks, as you can see from that style kit uh, with the fonts, um, just presenting the work and who we are, and then going into a bit of about myself and the mission with links. Uh, showing some of the offers that I have to link through a testimonial from a client and then um, a call to action. And I think this is the only actually section that I've used from Mono's uh, predefined layouts. The rest are unique blocks from the lovely uh, style kit that um, we offer within the library. Then I have an event studio page and this is totally different looking. I'm using a slider again from Mono, uh, but I've used our, um, I've used the crowd style kit. Um, most of the layouts on this page are using Mono's layouts, uh, but I also have a unique layout from uh, crowd uh, style kit. Um, as some of you might know, Crowd has a bit of a kind of a pastel colored um, imagery um, to go with the, with the overall style. I've decided to use some more saturated images, a bit bolder and a boho style here. Still, it looks amazing with the Crowd style kit here. So um, a big presentation of who we are, a latest wedding, uh, links to view all galleries, links to our services, a statement, and then a final call to action here as well. So. This is also all created within Mono. And finally, another one that I played around a bit with, um, and it uses our Osaka style kit uh, from, the, from the available library. Um, this one actually I built out with a style of Osaka style kit, but I did not use any of Osaka's specific or unique blocks. I've just used Mono options. I have free, um, free blog posts here at the top that I am featuring to link into. I'm presenting myself and I did a bit of a personalization here as well. I just used the script from Osaka and edited it up here just to add a 
just to add more character um, to present myself here, right? So then I have the top categories linking through. Um, I have a video here as well for a recipe. And again, adding a bit of that script here to add more character. And then finally, I have some quick links to my social media, to latest free posts as well that I want to focus on and just adding more uh, jazz to that by using that style, Osaka style here. So um, this is just another page, again, built with mono and it's all built with mono's pretty fine layouts, but just with Osaka style on top. These are all four very different pages, as you can see, uh, very different styles and businesses. And that's just a sneak peek into what you can do with mono. So uh, don't be fooled by this uh, clean, modern aesthetic. You can achieve your brand style with mono and you can play around with the layouts available within as well with the style kits, really hone your own branding with the help of this uh, amazing uh, flex theme that we are super excited to launch shortly this month. If you have any questions, make sure to connect with us. If you need recommendations, just shoot us a message and we'll be happy to help you out. And I'll see you in the next videos where I'll dive a bit more into the library of style kits to show you how that works, uh, what you can do with it, and how much flexibility really you have within uh, the theme plus a style kit, additional style kit to uh, truly create something unique and uh, personalized to your own branding. I'll see you all in the next videos.